beautiful woman I felt it deep inside Beautiful woman People are talking me down Beautiful woman You try to tell me what's right The road gets longer You turn all grey into white Oh And all the things I didn't say There's wrecking balls inside my brain Standing tall with all my faith Empty voices in my head And they will always be around Until I found the one again This is my spiritual morning routine I don't do this every day, but I like to do it as many days as possible. As you've just seen, I'll get up, I will put my headphones in, and while I'm brushing my teeth and making the kids breakfast, I'll listen to some like morning affirmations, just like, I'm grateful, I am strong, <laughs> all that kind of thing. Um, then what I like to do, I make myself a coffee. Got it here, hold on, is it? Oh. No, it's perfect. While the kids are eating their breakfast, I will sit and I will journal. I'll script about things I want to manifest or I'll just like journal about my day or things that want to happen in the day or things that happened yesterday. Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door You don't have to wake up yet We can spend all day in so that was just a really quick one this morning. I just sat there for like five minutes, if that, and just um, journaled out a load of affirmations, um, things that are true and things that I want to be true, but written as if they are true. Um, and it just sets me up for such positivity in my morning. So now it's like seven o'clock in the morning and I just feel so good. I've written down all these affirmations that make me feel so good inside. And it set me up for the day of just, positivity and feeling great just need to take those five minutes in the morning for me that i'd be sat drinking a coffee anyway to focus on my dreams and my goals and manifesting them and just being grateful for what i have just writing down i have an amazing family it reaffirms that in your head and it just makes you realize what you have and focus on what you want also <laughs> We always leave super early for the school run, not only because I have a massive fear of being late, but because it just means that we can take a super like chilled, mindful, easy, <laughs> slow walk to school, enjoy everything, really take in like everything we see, and be like practice gratitude for oh isn't that a beautiful tree isn't that isn't the weather lovely today and not only that delilah loves playing in the playground when we get to school so it's nice we get about 15 minutes early and she can have a little play in the playground and yeah it's just a nice slow walk in our mornings and gets us out in nature and in the fresh air I'll give you a couple of examples we've got some massive roadworks on our road at the minute and it is could be a massive inconvenience but you they're doing water pipes and you just think oh how grateful I am that I'm able to have running water through these pipes providing my house with water and we've got nice clean running water going to our home weather today is my absolute favorite it's really like crisp you can tell it's becoming autumny now and I've wrapped the children up so nice and cozy Dex has got his duvet in here hi and I've got three warm, beautiful, healthy little children. Lila's all the way down there. And yeah, it's just such a nice little walk in the morning. Delilah! And something else to be grateful for. Just got warm clothes to wear, warm blankets, legs to walk with, you know, our health. Yeah, it's just about practicing gratitude mainly. Like, I just like to really think, and it's easy not to do it. Like, don't, trust me, I'm not a natural, I have to try. 
I really try and make myself notice the positives. I never used to be a very positive person at all. I used to be such a negative person. But now I'm really trying to implement this into my life and it starts to become a bit more natural as you do it a bit more. How come the stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away? Show us where we are. What makes the sun go to sleep? Every night, and what's it dreaming what is it, baby? of? He's pointing up at this tree. I wonder. Is that a pretty tree? Nana. He's not got any nana on it. Nana. That tree's not got nana on it. No, it doesn't have any nana on it. Sometimes hides pears, behind the clouds. Yeah. Maybe it's just like pears. me, a little bit scared of no heights. Pears. We just got home, and now Dexter goes for a nap. And while he's napping, I'll probably put on a guided meditation and do like a 15 minute meditation. Um, just to, the walk there's lovely, the walk back, you get a bit of hot and a bit, Eliza's usually crying by then, so she's like cried a lot of the way back. So yeah, I now need to unwind and then I'll make myself a cup of tea. Today's a little bit different because I have friends coming over. Usually I would do a 15 minute meditation or so. Dex is asleep and then I'll do something for me like edit or read or something like that but today my friend's coming over so I'll probably just hang out with her. Dex and Eliza are both asleep. Oh. <laughs> they're both asleep now. So while they're asleep I will just put a guided meditation on the TV um, and it, I do different ones depending on my mood on the day so I'm just going to scroll through these and See what I fancy. That's finished. It wasn't exactly what I wanted, but it was okay. It was a 15 minute rest. So that's what I can ask for really. Usually I would do another one because I also went really quickly, but I am very aware that I have a lot of editing that needs doing and my friend is gonna be here anytime. So I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea and edit for the morning until my friend gets here. And then I'll go and pick Delilah up. So it's sort of the end of my like spiritual routine now, I suppose. As I'll carry these like practices throughout my day really. So I'll like continue with gratitude throughout the day, just being aware of all the things that I have to be grateful for and just have a bit of a slow living day. So yeah, I don't do this every day, but I always feel really good when I do. And I like to try and do it at least a couple of times a week, really focus on myself and my mind because it's good to keep our minds healthy as well as our bodies, isn't it? <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this bit of a different video. And if you have, give it a like if you like these sort of videos. And yeah, I hope you all have a beautiful day.